navigate to settings more tab if developer options are not activated go to about device scroll to build number tap it several times till developer options have been enabled message appears go back now you should have developer options enter and check usb debugging Step 2. Run Odin on your computer. Click AP or PDA. Browse and select your firmware image. Wait till it loads. Step 3. Windows usually automatically installs drivers, but not in our case. Just find and install manually your driver. Step 4. We need to start device in download mode. For this, press and hold next case, volume down, home and power. Hold them till a warning message appears on the display. Press volume up to continue. Now on your display should appear the Android logo with downloading text under it. Next step is to connect the USB cable to the computer. And in Odin, in the left upper corner, the IDCOM rectangle should get blue. This means it detected your device. Press start and wait till it finishes installing firmware. It should take up to 5-10 minutes. If something goes wrong, don't get scary. The baddest thing that could happen, your phone could freeze on the Samsung logo. Mainly it's because there was an error when Odin installed it or because you downloaded wrong ROM. Make sure you search a ROM by the model number in the About menu. That's all. Now remains to unplug the device, power it and wait till it makes updates. Subscribe to help me entertain this channel and bring others useful content. Goodbye.